And we've already unclogged the sewer. We've established water flow. So we're going to go take a look and see what caused the clog. If I can get the camera down the line. Okay. There's our high speed drilling machine that we used to initially unclog the line. And as you can see, the and the, uh, just so you know, the where the water is is the bottom of the pipe. The camera does not level itself. So we're up to the first root intrusion, which is only about 10 feet in, 8 to 10 feet in. And that's where the main clog was initially. There's the second set of root intrusion right here. And then another one there. Here's yet another root intrusion. Pretty much every section of this concrete sewer line has root intrusions. They're about two to three foot sections. I think they're two foot sections, I can't remember. But um, as you can see, there's root intrusions at each one of these. And not so bad the further down we go. The main one was that one uh, at 10 feet. Here's another one, that's not too good either. So what we're gonna do is use our high speed drilling machine and remove as many roots as possible. This looks like it can. All right, we're at the first section where the main issue was about, like I said, eight, nine feet down. Now we're gonna go ahead and clean that real quick and see what we can do. I'm gonna turn the microphone off. And as you can see, it's removing all of that roots 360 degrees. We've got a little bit of finger roots still stuck in there. Once I was able to get the machine pinpointed directly on the roots, I was able to effectively remove them pretty well. I'm going to do that one more time. Yeah, big difference. Now the pipe is fully open, whereas before when just a simple uh, traditional sewer cable was run, it just punched a hole through there. So I'm going to go ahead and stop the video, we'll clean the rest of the line, and then we'll do another video after everything's done. There we go, there was another section with major roots in it at 24 feet. Another section where we remove some roots. There's another section, got most of them out of there. Just got a little finger ones on the top, which those won't affect anything on flow. Another section where we remove roots. And this one is also kind of rough. This whole sewer line is in fair to poor condition uh, due to age and the fact that it's old concrete. And concrete does tend to become uh, very soft and brittle over time concrete sewer lines doing. This is another root intrusion that we've removed all the roots from. There's another. Another one right there. And then we're back into the PVC up to the house.